All right, here we go, y'all. Um, got my brother back in the building. It's always a special occasion when I got this guy. I could pin him down. We could sit down and just do what we do. Always a fun conversation. I'm Yo, ready. Welcome Fred, back to the show, Ray. Good to have you back in the building. You're looking good. I'm following you on the gram. You're looking like the Incredible Hulk over there. What's going on? Man, I just been working out, Prez. You know, um, I, I had took a, a about a six month hiatus from the gym. Was going through a lot, you know, just trying to get my life stable back together. But man, these last few months, I've been hitting the gym like I never had before. And man, it just feels good. It feels amazing. I'm back. It's like, and you know, with the gym, you got to get back into that flow. It's like, you know, physically, you know, your strength can come back because of mess muscle memory. But if your mental's not in it, it's hard to like start over. Like I gotta start over. I used to look like this and I gotta get, but man, I've, 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 I'm past that. And man, I, I just feel, I feel amazing, Press. I really appreciate it. I feel amazing. Okay, so let me just ask you straight up, like real talk, at, at this point in your life, what's your motivation? You know, I'll be 50, I'll be 58 next year, two from 60. Um, just that alone, just making it this far where we was just talking earlier where a lot of our guys that we grew up with just, man, it's, you know, it's, it's rare. You know, you could say 50, 60% of the people that you actually grew up with aren't here no more. And we're talking maybe 50, 100, 150, 200 people that you know and, and close to you because we're growing up in the hood and we're all, people don't, people take for granted how close we are when we grow up. We're all on top of each other, whether it's projects or living in homes close to each other. We all are close proximity to each other. So when you grow up in the hood and you grow up in the late seventies, the early eighties, you know, a lot, you, you, you look at it now and you just see, man, like maybe half of your childhood friends are wiped out, you know, and it's I just, you know, you know, I got a seven year old now, of course I got my other three, um, you know, adults, they're all adults now, but it's like, you know, I want to be here, man. I want to be here. I, my, I mentally, I feel real good. And I, I feel like I have a lot more to offer society and, and humanity. And I just feel like, I just feel like, man, if you work out, if you stay, you know, in, in motion, you know what I'm saying? If you eat well, you could definitely add years on to your life. And I, you know, that's the motivation. Nah, that's a great motivation. I'm gonna tell you something, um, you know, even as, even as all of us age, it's one thing to add years onto your life, but it's a whole other thing to add quality years onto your life. Like it's a lot of people here, but dudes is, you know, they ain't in good health. People walking with bad limps, people overweight, um, taking insulin back and forth to the hospital. You know, I always pray and I'm putting the work myself because I would to, to, to me, it's about quality of life. Like, like you. if I'm gonna be here, I pray to God that He bless bless me with good health and and, right. and a really good quality of life. No, oh, man. I, you know what? And and also it's like, you know, man, it's it's it just feels good when 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 you can come out here and you can do the things that the younger people are doing. There's nothing that these younger guys are doing that I can't do. And that alone feels good because, you know, hip hop has really kept us young at heart. Yep. You know, hip hop, the culture has kept us young at heart. If without hip hop, we probably we probably be a lot older than we than we portray to be. You know what I'm saying? And I think hip hop kind of injects that youth in you and you always keep it and you always want to because we're so close to, to the younger generation even though the younger generation thinks we're so far apart, they don't understand how really close we are. And, right. it, it, you know, it's, you know, I, listen, man, I want to be here. I got a seven year old man and Zeno, man, I want to, you know, I want to be able to be here, like you said, and, and have some quality time, go out, go outside and run with him. You know, he's, he loves running and I, and, and I love to run with him. So I don't want to lose that. What's up guys. Thanks for sticking with me to the end of the video. Truly appreciate you. If you like anything you heard here today, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And if you know anybody that can benefit from this message, feel free to share. Peace and love. Make every move a power move. And I'll catch you all on the next video.